Hi guys. Uh, this week I'm flying solo. Cooper uh, decided to sit this one out since I'm going to be covering more of a logistical topic. A topic I really thought would be, we're kind of like at this point in the feature, which is attaching a line producer. It's a topic that I think is super important because this is a very, very, very key member on any project, but specifically a film. And I've seen films where they've been really set back by hiring the wrong line producer. So first of all, what is a line producer? Your line producer is like your kingpin of your below the line. They often handle a lot of the above the line too, but they are the one essentially running the show. In this film where I'm both producing and directing it, I will not be producing on the shoot days because I will be directing. My line producer will be running the show. One thing that I can count on in a great line producer and is perfect for an indie film is a line producer that is well connected. That is <laughs> invaluable. I find a lot of the time people hire glorified production coordinators or glorified production managers or glorified ADs, all right, who are really good at scheduling or creating a budget. Doesn't necessarily mean they know how to stick to a budget. When looking for a line producer, you want someone that is connected. That's the person that's like, yes, I can find you those deals. One. Two, they have your crews back, meaning if there are budget cuts or you need to come under budget, the first place they do not go to is the crew pay. This is definitely something I cover in the producer boot camp. Um, if you don't know what that is, go to the Jax Productions website. It's all there. It's a course. But it's about finding someone who, and people I've interviewed, and the one we're probably going to go with, is someone who's in, very well connected. Um, they're providing value in their Rolodex. Something my dad and I always talk about is Rolodex wealth, okay? Rolodex wealth is essentially your relationships, your valuable relationships that essentially then you capitalize on, okay? That gives you as a person value because I'm now hiring you because of your Rolodex, because of your relationships, because of your expertise in the business. Something very, very important when hiring a line producer. Anyone these days can call themselves a line producer because, like I said, they know how to budget, they know how to schedule. But do they have that Rolodex wealth? It's really, really important. Now, also something to remember too, when you are bringing on a line producer that maybe has more experience than you do, you have to make sure it's still a collaboration and not a steamroll. All right, you're not handing over the movie to them. It's still your movie. It's still your project. Um, and so that's something I really wanted to talk about as we're going through this experience of attaching a, attaching a line producer. That relationship is so important. It's such a key position. It's really important that, again, <laughs> they provide value and it's someone that you can collaborate with as well as learn from. Okay? So that's our weekly vlog. It's a short and sweet one for uh, this week. And we'll catch you again next week. Thanks, you guys. Bye.